Sharon Osbourne lost 30 pounds in just four months on the drug Ozempic, but admits it came with some side effects which left her throwing up most days for the first few weeks. Sharon Osbourne has come off the diabetes drug Ozempic, which she credits for her rapid weight loss. The talent manager lost a staggering 30 pounds in four months after using the injected drug. The 70-year-old claimed that as a Jewish girl, with a big mum and dad, she inherited their physiques and wanted to shed pounds. With this, she resulted to taking Ozempic after trying everything beforehand. Such a change to the body, however, came with consequences for her. Speaking on Bill Maher's podcast club Random about her experience, she revealed she was left throwing up most days while getting used to the injection. You're not hungry, on the drug, but for me, the first few weeks was f asterisk 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 gs asterisk t because you just throw up all the time and feel so nauseous, she explained, of the well-known side effect. After a couple of weeks it goes, and then you're fine, you feel nothing, you're just not hungry. The former X Factor judge went on to say she had been using the injection since December, but came off of it a few months ago. When asked if her body had now changed back to how it was and if her appetite improved, she said, not for me. I think your stomach shrinks and you change. I'd been on it since December but I came off a couple of months ago. Sharon added that by this point, she would have normally craved pasta but hadn't. The likes of Elon Musk, Chelsea Handler and Amy Schumer are just many names who have also admitted to using the drug in the past. The latter, however, said her experience was similar to Sharon's and that she eventually came off the drug because she felt so sick. According to diabetes.org.uk, Ozempic is a type 2 diabetes medication which is prescribed to manage blood glucose levels. It is not a medication for people who do not have diabetes or are at risk of type 2 diabetes. A prescription for Ozempic should only be administered following an assessment by your healthcare team to make sure that you'll benefit from its use. The website adds that several important factors will need to be considered before a prescription can be given.